Hey everybody, Chris Pierdomenica from DorkDaily.com. I am here with Elias Grover himself, Trevor Fairman. How are you, Trevor? I'm good, how are you? Great, great. So I heard that this is your first con. Um, what is that experience like for you, just having people come up to you, want to take your picture, uh, getting your autograph? What, what has that been like? Did you imagine you'd ever be to a point like this? Yeah, I mean, when I walk down the street, I'm often mobbed by people. Like, did you ever see um, that Beatles movie? Uh, Across the Universe? No, no the... Uh, oh, oh, I know. Yesterday, right? No. I don't know. No, forget it. I was a, it was a joke. No, it's it's super cool. Though. I like it. It's Yeah, I've never been to one. Uh, it's nice to see everybody. Um, everybody's super nice. Like, yeah, I, it's great. So were you a fan of Clerks before you joined Clerks 2? Were you, uh, I know you were in Jeff's film. Now you know, and that's how you got involved in Clerks 2. Uh, were you, would you say you were a View Skew fan before that? Yeah, uh, I liked Clerks. I'd seen Clerks right shortly before I was in Jeff's movie, and I liked it a lot. And then I was a fan um, of Mallrats and Chasing Amy, I think, in, partic in particular. I was a big fan of Chasing Amy. So, yeah, I, I knew, like, the... The Esk Universe uh, characters and stuff like that. And yeah, went a bit, went, by the time I met Kevin, I, I knew who he was and his movies and stuff like that. Yeah. So I have to ask you this, and I apologize in advance, but who would win in a fight, Pillow Pants or Lister Fiend? Good question. Um, something I've given a lot of thought to. Uh, man, it's tough. I think probably Pillow Pants. Uh, he's got those sharp dick biting teeth and uh, yeah, Listerfiend's not established in canon, so we don't really know what he, I, I suppose we could imagine that he bites tongues. I don't know. Toss up. Hard to say. Women. Women. What can fans be most excited about with Clerks 3 uh, coming out? I mean, I'm sure, I mean, just it being Clerks 3, but what, you know, as a fan, what do you think they should be the most excited about? Um, definitely me, uh, by process of, well, okay, so certainly not Jeff. Uh, we saw the movie a couple of nights ago and, you know, he's fine. Like, it's like, he tried his best. Uh, no, I'm just kidding. I, uh, I think that fans are, are going to like it. It's like really, um, it's really heartfelt and I can't give any spoilers obviously, but it's like, yeah, I think it goes to some pretty crazy places. Elias has some really funny stuff to do and, uh, yeah. And it's really, you know, it's got that Kevin Smith heart, you know, now, I don't, you, you don't have to answer this if you can't right now, what would Elias do on a film set? Like what would kind of be his job? And that's a great question. Um, Something very, like the most menial, yeah, the most thankless task. Like he would, he would, he would be like a PA who everybody yells at and, to, you know what I mean? Like the, doesn't get any respect from anybody. Although our PAs were awesome and did get respect. I feel like I just insulted PAs and that was not what I intended to do. I think you more insulted Elias, just that he would even be like below that. Yeah. Sorry, PAs. I love you. Um, how about like with, well, we have six Transformers movies now. What would Elias make of that? I mean, that's, I think at the time it was the, the first one hadn't even come out yet, right? Yeah, I don't think it had come out yet. That's a good question too. I, how would Elias feel? It's an interesting question. How would Elias feel about the Transformers movies? There are more than meets the eye. <laughs> I guess he'd like them probably. Yeah, I don't think he's like a, he's not a snobby cinema goer and he's all about the Transformers. But did, I don't, I never really liked the, I never got into the cartoon when I was a kid and I didn't really watch the movies. Do the movies capture the, what was the feel and like what was cool about the cartoon? Because I don't think that the Ninja Turtles movie captures the Ninja, like Ninja Turtles is my Transformers. Gotcha. So I, you know what I'm saying? So well, in your opinion? It's, it's hard to say because I, I didn't really watch Transformers uh, growing up. I was I was a big Power Rangers guy. That was my thing. Uh, and I felt like their new movie captured kind of the essence of the series while kind of making it new. Uh, I would say with Transformers, I mean, I it's just so many. Just get the man a tripod, you know. Uh, that's all I have to say. No hate, you know, Michael Bay, but. Oh, because it's shaking. Yeah, it's all shaking all the time. And, uh, you know, I, I did like the first one. First one I thought was really good. 
Okay, yeah. Well, I, I, because I'm just wondering, like, if Elias really loved the cartoon, would he have kind of not liked the movies because he felt like they weren't faithful to the cartoon? But I can't say because I don't have never seen any of them. I could see like Randall saying to Elias, like, "I told you so." Yeah, yeah. Like Elias is just like bitterly disappointed, and and Randall is like twisting the knife. I could see that scene. Yeah. I hope that's a scene. But um, what have you been up to in, in all this time um, since Clerks Two, uh, Two Clerks Three? Uh, are there any other projects that you've worked on, or anything that your fans can check out online or on TV? Uh, no, I'm not in show business. I don't. I don't. Uh, I haven't been doing it for since Clerk, since Clerks Two. Uh, so yeah, right now I'm an engineer for, I work at Target right now, uh, on their UIs and, uh, yeah, I'm not, I'm not an actor. Sure. So you have a lot in common with Jeff in that sense. Like he kind of is also is not into the whole showbiz thing except for clerk stuff. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. They, I, I did this movie cause I like hanging out with these guys and it was funny script and I, I really like performing and stuff. It's just not, I'm not doing it anymore. Sure. You're doing the parts that you like. You're like, you don't feel obligated to do stuff that you don't want to do. Well, Kevin did say I had to do this or he would show everyone those pictures. Will we see those pictures in Clerks 3? Not, no, not, not if I can help it. I mean, I, you know, he promised he wouldn't show them, so. Yes, yes, and he would, he would never tell a lie. I, now you're making me really paranoid, like, <laughs> fuck. I just shouldn't have, yeah. I shouldn't have fucked that donkey. Well, better luck with Clerks 4. So, uh, all right, Trevor, thanks so much for talking to us, man. And uh, we can't wait to see the film. Thanks for coming out uh, to the con, and uh, we'll see you in Clerks 3. Okay. All right, nice thank you so much. Great to meet you. Nice to meet you, too.